Hey everybody, it's Cooking with JTB. What we have here is a little queso dip, some salsa, a little taco seasoning, some delicious ground beef, a jalapeno, some onions, and some tortillas. Oh, we're gonna make tacos? Maybe not. We're gonna be making the quesadilla burger. All right, now we're gonna start cutting up and dicing up this onion. Gonna do a couple cuts lengthwise, and then gonna flip it around and then cut it the other way. Just wanna dice up a little bit of onion, just put it into the ground beef mix. And dice it all nice and fine. All right, now it's time to dice up that jalapeno. First, you're gonna cut off the tip, then you're gonna cut it down the middle, then kinda gut it out, get all the seeds and that other stuff out of there. Then start dicing it all up. Woo, spicy. You got your jalapenos diced, you got your onions diced. Now it's time to add them to the ground beef here. And then you wanna add a little bit of that taco seasoning. You know, a lot of people wanna, oh, I'll make my own seasonings. Eh, might as well just get it from the store. It's just as good and a whole lot easier. And so you just wanna go ahead and mix that up. And then after you're done mixing that up, it's a quesadilla burger, right? Just gonna go ahead and make some burger patties for your burgers. Nice, simple kind of. Just go ahead, I like to always just get a ball going and then kind of pound them out a little bit. Boom, 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 boom. Think you need a little bit more ground beef in that one? Just add a little bit more. Not a big deal, but just kind of. Boom, 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 boom. Circle them up. Got a nice little patty there. All you want to do is just kind of toss them in the pan. You're looking about maybe four to five minutes a side. Get them to a nice little medium, medium, medium well, a little bit in between there. I like my medium. Cook them how you want. It's your, it's your quesadilla burger. All right, guys, why the uh, burgers are searing up on that first side. S simple little mixture of a little queso dip and a little bit of salsa. Kind of three spoonfuls of the queso, or let's make it two. Then you're looking about three uh, spoonfuls of the salsa. Just easier than chopping up all those vegetables and putting in the quesadilla. Sorry, I'm a little bit lazy. Rather just do something that's already nice and cooked up and made up and chopped up and everything. And I always like to go chunky salsa. It's the best way to go. Then you just wanna kinda of just mix that together. Then you'll see what we'll do with this in a minute. But it looks like it's been about four to five minutes so I gotta flip those burgers. Nice little flip there. Just flip there, look at that caramelization on that other side of that burger. Perfect. Get a little flip right there. Those are looking good. Like I said, about another four minutes on that side and you should be good to go. Woo, this burger's looking good. Well, all right now, now it's time to get your tortillas working. Got them working, got a little butter in the pan. Then what you're gonna do is you're gonna Take that delicious salsa queso mix you kind of mixed up together. I'm gonna spread that around. You go from the center kind of to the outside, but not all the way outside because it will spread by itself. All right, now after you have that one down, you're gonna grab your burger patty. You're gonna put it on top. Then you're gonna take your queso dip salsa mix, kind of spread it around the one that you're about to top it with. Once you get that going and the bottom one nice and golden brown, you're gonna flip that tortilla. Ooh, I think it's ready to flip. Oh yeah. Look at that horrible, delicious, delicious mess right there. Mm, mm, mm. Looks like this bad boy is done. Mm, mm, mm. 
Ooh, ooh, mm. Look at that. Mm, mm, mm. Juice is still flowing. Man, this is looking really good. Mm, mm, mm. Yummy, yummy. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. And that's how big guys eat. Oh yeah, look at that.